I was paying 70 US my cubicle, but it rose by 100% to 140, of which that one is out of reach. The workers at Bulawayo Small and Medium Enterprises are crying over the high rents that the ministry is demanding. We've got a current challenge. When we, this is uh, from the first month, the, 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 this place was renovated. Renters were affordable. They went. Uh, they were. I was paying 70 US my cubicle, but it rose by 100 percent to 140, of which that one is out of reach. I can't afford to pay for that. I'm struggling to pay for it, but mm, they're going stuff. They are also crying over the currency the administration is demanding them to pay in. Eh, so we have come with very early era teachers. Yet era teachers, you might tell us that they are born. Now we go to buy from something. Apa, you use any malo or something like we have patala. We go have a good one. Eh, man, just about totally about fun era teachers. Totally about fun in your cash. About fun that you use. Sometimes you have been in the order, I'm even part of the RTG through my pings. We have one. We have been meeting a chatty man, a pinging a tenga EUSA. Labana would tenga give off with irritia be pants, Missalang a loot. A certain escort say like who mending a engine lunch. They accept a lapa e RTG. Zemji Pisinus engaged the SMS programs coordinator in Getamango Lamini, who revealed that they are trying to find solutions and as well as explain the challenges they are facing as the SMS chambers. With more than 10 meetings where we're discussing this issue, where we're discussing how we can actually handle the, the payment of, of, of rentals, uh, where we're putting payment uh, arrangements, so someone pays over some, some time, and then, uh, so that then we allow people to, to, to pay over time. But I think it's an issue of how do we instill the discipline. Uh, because if, if I'm paying, say, $60, uh, if I'm disciplined enough, I can, I can pay, pay it maybe over a month, or every month I can pay something. But if I allow it to, to move to three months, four months without payment, then you know it might be difficult for me to handle. So I, I wouldn't want to exactly say uh, high rentals, but I think it's how do we manage our affairs in terms of payment of rentals. I think that's what we're now trying to discuss in meetings. How do we assist our business people? How do we assist our SMEs actually put that discipline of every, making sure that every money they make, they put, they put aside a certain percentage for, say, for rentals. Reporting for ZMGP Seniors, Angela Mlojua. Well,